this is not financial advice, not legal advice for entertainment and educational purposes only. And anything I say is my opinion. Please don't make any financial decision based on anything I say in this video. That being said, hit the like button, subscribe button, or YouTube album stuff so you get the videos I put them out. See what I'm thinking? See, I'm analyzing that data, but I got tail every day. The data they release us is false. Money gives a false narrative of the market. So we can make bad trading decisions. Listen, the public company accountant advisory board has fined Malcolm LLP a $3 million civil penalty on top of a $10 million penalty. And Malcolm LLP is a SPAC, which is like a a special purpose acquisition company. So when companies are about to go public, they kind of decide the value, they do the investigation, and they're supposed to protect retail investors. Well, protect all investors who might be who might want to invest in this SPAC, okay? But here's the thing. They found out that in 25 to 50% of the investigation of the companies that they that they investigated, they had violations in 25 to 50% of them. So you have to think, how much money were they making by allowing these violations to continue? To engage in this activity. They didn't engage in this activity because it wasn't profitable. They engaged in these violations because these violations made more profit for the company. I mean, that's really the bottom line. So when they're fined three million and ten million dollars, why don't you tell us how much money they made from these violations? And in twenty five to fifty percent of all the companies that they audited i mean that sounds to me like this was their modus operandi this is how they did business okay this is how they did business and then <laughs> they're gonna say that when you put profits ahead of standards there will be consequences what consequences? What consequences? They fined thirteen million dollars, and they probably made a billion dollars by violating the rules. So, is it really consequences? I don't think so. But the public company accounting oversight board thinks that fining them thirteen million dollars is consequences. Yet. Now, now, I don't know for sure, but I am willing to bet that they made a lot more than $13 million breaking the law, violating the rules. Anyway, please leave some comments. Tell me what you think. Do you think if they were fined $13 million, how much do you think they made from violating the rules? Do you think they made a whole lot more violating the rules? <laughs> anyway, have a great day. God bless. And I appreciate y'all on this journey with me.